a face shape, so if you don't know what hairstyle is going to suit you, probably a side part could work for you. And then on top of that, it's super versatile. When you have a side part, you can go with a flat, shiny, and dapper look when you want to look classy and dressed up. And for just your everyday looks, you can go with something more casual by just switching up the product you use to a matte product and adding a little bit of more volume. In this same casual category, you could try something called a textured comb over. It's kind of like a variation of the side part, except it's meant to look more messy and more casual. The third hairstyle you should definitely consider for 2017 is the brush up. Now this hairstyle is literally you just brushing up your hair to give it some textured volume. What I really like about this hairstyle is that it looks effortless, like you didn't spend hours trying to style your hair and it doesn't look as perfect as the pompadour. And again, the great thing about this hairstyle is that it doesn't matter if you have straight, curly or wavy hair, most men can pull it off. If you have any type of hair that's sort of manageable, as long as you can brush it up and add some textured volume, you can pull off this look. Now the fourth hairstyle is definitely one of the most trendiest ones and that's the high skin fade pompadour or pomp. Now the only downside with this hairstyle is that really only guys with wavy to straight hair look best in this hairstyle. I have seen some curly alternatives but usually wavy to straight hair looks best and on top of that requires high maintenance both to keep the sides and the fade nicely fresh and also a lot of work in the morning to keep that pompadour looking perfect. But hey, other than that, if you got that perfect hair, give it a shot because it's definitely going to look awesome and it's going to get some heads turning. Number five is the buzz cut. Now, not everybody can rock the buzz cut and I kind of actually envy those who can. And that's because this is the most low maintenance haircut that you'll ever pull off. You don't have to spend time or money on any hair products or all that time in the morning worrying about styling your hair. On top of that, if you're one of those guys that looks great in a buzz cut, you know that you can roll straight out of bed and you'll never have to worry about having a bad hair day. I mean, that's just lucky. And of course, I can't forget about my African American viewers. I told you, if you have super coarse hair, there's still some really awesome and dapper hairstyles that you can be pulling off. I mean, you don't call me Jose Zaniga for nothing. Whether you're Spanish or African American, I know how hard that hairstyle is to manage, but there's a lot of really good hairstyles that you can try out that will make you look stylish this year. For example, you can try the skin fade with waves. Usually if you have coarse hair, you don't want a lot of hair on the side, so skin fades are always the best way to go. And then you can add waves on top to add texture to coarse hair. But this is a great and sharp option to try this year that requires just a little bit of maintenance. Now number seven is a favorite of mine and that's the low top. This is great if you want to add a little bit of volume to your coarse hair and want to add some length to your face. Now you have a couple variations that you could try with the low top depending on the like how coarse your hair is, but you can try anything from an afro to just rock in your curls or try something like sponge curls. To me, either of those options look amazing. And finally, try a side part with a hard part. Now, I know in a previous video, I said that hard parts are not the way to go, especially if you have straight or manageable hair. But to clarify, I meant that more to people that can, like I said, manage and make their own hard part. But if you have super coarse hair where you can't comb a side part, then a hard part is your best alternative and it, you will look just as dapper. So a hairstyle that you could try is definitely the hard part where it's going to make you look a little bit more dapper. It's a more classic alternative to the previous two that I just talked about. But again, it's something definitely to try out this year if you haven't done so. The only downside is that it, re that it requires the most maintenance because you have to be sure to keep that line always clean. If not, you're losing the side part. All right, guys, so that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. These are some of the best hairstyles for 2017 that you could try if you're bored with your hairstyle and just want to switch things up a bit. If you like this video, don't forget to drop us a like down below and share this video as well. 